Hey, what's up YouTube? It is Captain Shock here and today I'm bringing some TDM gameplay on the map Frost and I'm going to be talking about what is my favorite pistol in the game and you can actually see me sniping here as well, well trying to, I'm not the best sniper, I'm not a top tier sniper guys, I just use a sniper just to have fun at times or to get my dark matter camo challenges done. Now you can see me pulling out the Hornet pistol and this pistol puts in work. It's actually better than some submachine guns and shotguns actually. I really like it when I use it. It's one of the most fun pistols used. It's a fully automatic pistol. The fire rate is extreme. You go through your ammo very quickly. So that's why I like equipping extended mags. Now you see me also using hollow point in this video as well on the pistol that's because i was trying to get some camo challenges done for it but for the most part you just need extended mags and get your head popped boy don't try me this is optic shock you're talking about here face shock oh man sniping is so fun at times so the hornet look at the time to kill off this weapon it is legit a melting time to kill it is very consistent but of course the dong sides to it as always there is a dong side to every good thing the range is not that great however you're using a pistol right so what kind of range do you want on a pistol anyway so just keep it within a close a very close range and of course sometimes you can hit a bit further if you control the recoil so if you can hit your shots on target like that you can get a, a nice bit of range on it and of course you have to be aggressive with this weapon but this guy with a shotgun he kills me but I will get my revenge on him just stay tuned so I'm just pre-aiming here with my sniper rifle just chilling out I don't have to try hard too much just you know scoping them out but I pull up my pistol he came at me he got wrecked he got destroyed and it's almost unfair what this weapon can do because sometimes if at the correct ranges they have no chance once you use this pistol so definitely try it out you can see the shotgun guy came at me this time two of them got blasted look at that look at that nice juicy headshot and it always feels so good when you're going for those camo challenges you need to get those headshots done right so it always feels so good to get those multi headshots and sniping can actually be very relaxing so if you're sniping definitely put the hornet on as a secondary and try it out I get another headshot here, I'm moving up. You guys know I like to push on this side of the map, so even using not really a try hard setup, I'm still following the exact procedures, the exact strategies and tactics that I teach you guys. I'm using it here as well, and you can see it working very well, no matter the weapon that you use. Now at this point, the shotgun guy is getting angry, he's looking for me, I jump in the air, I close that range, and I blast him with that hornet now i rewind i ran out of ammo there i slide around i killed him destroy him and moving away now i'm pushing back here so if you slide and use the pistol as well it helps you a lot it makes you almost unstoppable so you definitely use a sliding mechanic when going for those pistol camo challenges now look at the red dot on the mini map so I immediately turn around come this side and normally I never push that side but because I'm using a hornet and the time to kill is so quick I could challenge that because it would have given me the advantage. It's a close range, it's a very melty weapon and I just engaged in the gunfight and I even destroyed this guy as well. You're seeing the power of this hornet pistol and don't nerf this hornet guys it's a fun weapon to use. If you keep range on them, you can beat a Hornet user if you put some range between yourself and a Hornet user. So I wouldn't say it's OP, it's just a very top tier secondary weapon that is consistent and I love consistency. And you can see how easily I got my streaks with this gun. So of course on smaller maps you can actually use this gun as a primary and do well. In fact as long as you keep your distances correctly you can use it on any map and just control those ranges. So let me know how it goes when you try it out. Definitely equip extended mags on it. If you want, put some hollow point on it as well if you're going for those camo challenges. And you can see they have no time to react when using this weapon. It's like a mini shotgun basically. The secondary weapons in this game are actually really good. Sometimes I, I hear complaints about the secondaries and I'm like, no, you're probably not. Most likely you're not using the secondary weapon correctly. That's why you think it's bad. But if you use it correctly, 
you can see the damage that it does so of course don't interfere with the secondaries the secondaries are fine as they are so as the game comes to a close guys remember to leave a like if you enjoyed this hornet beat dog and i tried using the sniper so leave a like if you did please share the videos guys if you want to see me grow i would appreciate it as always and do subscribe if you haven't already 34 kd take care bye good job report to command for d